And I'm Leela Feinstein. In tonight for Cher Calvin, the news at 6 starts right now. Indeed, look absolutely beautiful for everyone headed out to Coachella. It's going to be hot, but it looks like, first of all, I want to welcome back Micah, back to KTLA, and we missed you very much. From the looks of your tan, it looks like you had a great time. It was good to be gone and good to be back. Excellent, excellent. Well, and back to great weather. Sure. Last week, this time, we were talking about nasty weather. <laughs> That's right. Exactly. And, yep. Los Angeles Mayor Antonio Villaraigosa has proposed a budget cutback that upset five big city unions. Jim Nash has more on the mayor's controversial new budget. An apology in court today to the parents of Trayvon Martin. Also at six. Well, in his first public appearance since the death of Trayvon Martin, shooter George Zimmerman offered an apology to the teenager's parents. Hollywood, the big O is ready to tie the knot, apparently. That's right. A little surprising, Michael. We all knew yeah. that the, her, her network was failing, but yeah. this seems like a, a very interesting move. Sources yeah. told the National Enquirer Oprah is going to marry longtime partner Stedman Graham. The, that is tough. Just because the big movie fails, then you're Doggy out dog. of the job. I aye guess aye so. Aye. Yeah. Look out. That was a big flop for sure. All right, still to come. Does your. All right, thank you, Vera. And that's it for the news at six. KTLA News continues next, right here at 6 30. Well, a report from New Zealand says a woman's two-gallon-a-day Coca-Cola consumption contributed to her death. The 30-year-old homemaker and mother... And for more health news anytime, go to ktla.com forward slash health. I'm Leela Feinstein. Micah, back to you. Okay, Leela.